All right, back at Old Farm. Beautiful start this morning. I had a flat tire, eh, so I got my spare on. Picked up John, and I picked up Mark. And we're going to get the van going, get the trailer real quick, and run to Garfield. We got a 125. We also have a uh, 300 stock with some koi. And we got a 120 to 25-inch uh, red tail to pick up. All right, stay tuned, everybody. All right, we got the trailer hooked up. We got our tubs. We got a couple pumps just in case. Hoses, tie downs. I think we got everything we need. So we get our butts over there and get this uh, done. All right, we're in Garfield. We're at Joe's. Take a look at the outside. shovel guys we really don't need the rock or the substrate no that we're, we'll just dump on the side of the garage okay that'll work um we'll get the you want to put them in the big one then or one of the small ones big one probably that's what i think because mm -hmm. it didn't look like there was that many uh koi yeah. I don't think there's really any Yeah, we can get them into the two smaller yeah. containers, yeah. All right, so we'll get our big container in here, or we'll run a hose or something. We'll get water out there. That pump and sucks. <clears throat> it's really slow. <laughs> we got a couple with us. Right. And then uh, we'll get this empty, cleaned out, get it out. Um, he said we can go right through the front door. Yeah, yeah. So then we Straight can put up. it right onto the back of the thing and the stand as well yeah. and then we'll get in the back and get those emptied and transfer them over all right we'll get this on the road all right we're already on the move john's got the pump inside oh mark get that kink right there man otherwise we ain't getting no water no right there in the yeah there we go now we're getting some water all right, we'll get this filled up. We're cleaning out here. Our two tubs of coil will be right here. And uh, we'll get this uh, done as quick as possible. Because if I can get this done and I can get out to my brothers, I'm getting some free tires. So we're gonna try and make this work. The guys were with me when he called, so they know what's up. But yep, yep. Uh, just gonna hurry up, fill this up. That's a beautiful red tail. He's two footer easy. So we'll get that and we'll get the tank in here. We'll get it tied down along with the stand. The 300's going to John's house. He got it, <laughs> finally. So, and I'm sure we'll probably take the parts in it and stuff. Uh, so we gotta make room for that stuff too. Yeah. Or no, we can actually put it probably in the tank or the, uh, uh, the well, not the tub, because you're gonna take the tub. That's what I'm saying. We don't wanna put it in the tub. We'll put it either in the tank or in the stand. So we'll leave the tub empty so you can take it, bam, and go. Put the gravel in one of these and then take it to the garage? Yeah, we can do that. I don't know what else we Unless he's got a five-gallon bucket. We'll have to ask him. They're, you, they're in the process of moving, like you see. Okay. Yeah. If, you, if you want, if it's getting pretty low, 
grab them, bring them, let the rest come on in. And, you know? All right. You can do that. And he's a big boy. So I got Mark in the back with that other hose starting to drain the uh, back one. And this is already ready uh, for the tank. So, uh, yeah, go ahead and net them. Let's net them. Because he'll fill up some of that room. And we probably will have enough then. Yeah, if he can get his head turned around, it'd be great. Come on, buddy. There you go. We just... All right, you want to go that way? Hey. Beautiful. Swim right in. Lovely. Oh. Ooh, watch, don't break it. All right. Easy, easy, don't trip. <laughs> you fall, he fall, everybody fall. <laughs> oh yeah, he's not cooperating. Okay. We got plenty of water, don't we? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. All right. He's got more room to turn around yeah. now. I got a shower. All right, yeah, he's a big boy. All right, we'll get the cover and we'll get air on him. All right, John, just getting the rest of the rocks removed. And we'll get the rest of the water. Some of the pebbles got stuck up in the impeller. That's what you're hearing. Joe's been saying he's been doing this now for two weeks. How many tanks? Two weeks, 32 tanks I've been moving. 32 tanks. Yeah. Wow. Not fun. That's why I'm all bruised up. <laughs> my, my legs and everything are bruised from moving shit. Were they all over the house or you got in the basement? Oh, wow. yeah. The whole house was full? Yeah. And what kind of uh, fish did you have then? Everything from guppies, shrimp, uh, cichlids. African ones, leaf fish. Really? Everything. Right. Very, very, very. Right. Yeah. I tell him I, I sell it to, uh, Agno Aquatics every once in a while. Well, okay. And I, uh, also go to the NEO auction and sell ah. a lot of stuff there. I'm going to have a lot of stuff with them on H14, so we bet. Okay. All right, well, this is almost ready, man. All right, tank's empty, Mark's up rolling up the hose. We're just gonna take the rest of this stuff out. And we'll be ready to bring the tank out through the front door. I don't even put it in until we get the tubs in. We'll put it in the tub on top of the tubs. Yeah, just. And then what we'll do is come straight out the front door and straight in. We'll just bring it right out the door and put it right in there and stand right next to it. Okay. Anybody need help? Watch a step right there. Another one. And one yeah, more. Step right there. There we go. First step. Second. Okay. Yep. Yeah, we got it. There we go. <clears throat> A little bit towards you. Get a stand out. I'll tie that down while they're taking care of the back. Hey, Mark, 
Are you doing it in the back? I'm sorry? Were you yeah. <laughs> Please. Please. <laughs> Alright, Joe and John, they're gonna get to stand real quick. Mm -hmm. And the stand. Did you make the stand or? My uncle and my cousin, I bought this. I was going to say, it looks too well built to be a store bought stand. <laughs> Going the same way, sideways? Just like that. Oh, your door open. Perfect. How was that in the back? Did you turn it off? Turn it off. It, uh, it drained in the back pond. No. No? It stopped miraculously right on perfect schedule. Okay. You know? <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't. <laughs> All, right. All right. And then, uh... Get the coin out and then the gar last. What's that? Oh, yeah. The gar will grab last. Do you want to fill some water and bring it up, or...? For the koi? Yeah. For the koi? We'll just carry it. There's not that many. Well, we got two. Oh, you gotta have one for the gar. He has to have warm water. Okay. Well, all right, there you go. <laughs> all right, while you, while you guys take that back, get it filled, start capturing them, I'm gonna get all this shit tied in. Yeah, to right the yeah. ad. And here, uh, alright, seeing if there's any koi hiding in here. Yeah, nope, not. I got it. Whew. Four, eight, nine. Yeah, they're nice and calm. tank and the stand tied in they ain't going nowhere and they started catching the koi so we'll go back and check on that and see how it's going oh they already got where did where to go then oh <laughs> oh <laughs> holy cow that bad, bad. It's empty just a little bit. You don't need that much. Mm. No, we're a half hour away. And you know as well as I do air breathers. We still got air we can put on them too, so. Yeah, it'll be fine. I didn't even know it was empty yet. <laughs> How cool. Hey Mark? Yes. I didn't do it. <laughs> I didn't get it on. <laughs> yeah, they got all on my side. <laughs> Alright, we'll could climb in from the other side, John. Yeah. We'll get it in here. Alright, we'll get a nice little picture of them. Nice arrangement. You said there's 20 or so then? Yes, 20. 20. Okay, you said 20 to 30. Here's 20 and exactly. Some pretty ones. Uh, no butterflies, huh? 
Oh yeah, that's a butterfly right there. For sure. Nice. Okay. All right, Mark's hooking up the air for these guys right now. Yeah, there is one nice butterfly in here at least. That one with the uh, orange face and the black body is really nice. I like that one. The almost black, pure black yeah. with the orange. I see he's right here. I'm filming him as you're talking about him. All right. All right, so we got the uh, red tail. We got the koi. The pond is right around the corner. We can slap that in the back. But we have a gar real quick. And it looks like they already took the container, so they're probably getting the gar right now. Yeah, it's awesome. Well, not awesome, but it's cool to see. Is he in here? Yeah, he's in there. Oh, there he is. Okay. That's your last tank in the house? No. No? <laughs> So this is the last fish. Okay, and we can load up and get out of here. Yeah, we're making good time. Yes, we are. I'm gonna get new tires. <laughs> yeah, we got time to go get something to eat. I'm starving. Yeah. <laughs> You're always starving. Yeah. <laughs> Sock network out good on the koi? Yeah, not so well on the tire though. Unfortunately, that was all that we had. He didn't have a net. He had a big ass one. Right yeah, that one you can leave loose. There's, there's no holes in this one. Snap down the, and then that's it. The hose, if we can, if we can squeeze it in there, that'd be perfect. You can put it right on the side over here, right? Pardon? Yeah, you know what? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. We're not taking anything else. We're just they're bringing the uh, pond, I believe, right now. So yeah, we can put all that there. Yeah, here they come with the pond. Rubbermaid as usual. Best brand there is. <laughs> that baby slid right in and locked itself in. We just got to get a strap across and we'll be uh, able to get on the road here. All right, we got everything loaded. Thank you, Joe. We appreciate everything, man. And uh, where are you moving to? Is it close or? Parma. Oh, Parma. Yeah. Oh, even closer then. Yeah. No, so it's... you can come see your red tail. Yeah. Does he have a name yeah. perchance or no? Tank. Tank? Yep. Tank the red tail. Okay, now we know. Got All right. Name. I haven't had long enough to name him. Okay. Well, hey, anytime you want to stop by, just give us a call. Yes, we'll set it up. All right, well, we're going to get this stuff going. And actually, we're going to go to John's and drop this off first. He's so happy. Remember to stay <laughs> fishy, my friends. Yeah, there you go, dude. <laughs> you know he watches our videos. Yeah, all, all right, guys. <laughs> all right, we're here. We're going to get this dropped off and get going. That was easy. 
<laughs> All right, we made it back. How's that red tail looking? Pretty good. Yeah. Good man. Morning. What's that? The trailer has made it another trip. It did. <laughs> no problem. So, it's about a two and a half, uh, two foot, a good two foot red tail. Oh, really? Yeah, take a look. He's right there. He's nice nice size. Tank. Pretty too. Nice. Mm-hmm. Little eight inch uh, alligator jar and 20 koi. And 20 koi. At least one butterfly, one nice butterfly in there. Yep. Wood decorations, some more over here. Ouch. Stop. Stop. You looking for something in particular? This is reptile stuff. Yeah, it's all reptile. Yep, yep, yep. absolutely. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it is. Boy. It's bulging. I told Jerry we're here. So. Did you? Okay. Yeah, look at the size of bulging. Right. Here, here, hold stop. Oh, okay. You want to dump some water? You're good, you're good. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. It should be about good. Yeah, that's about good. How big is he? Big. He's about two foot. Two footer. He's going to have to go on the 350. Mm -hmm. He's pretty big. Well, put the wheels back under him? I'll drag. Yeah, he'll drag. Okay. Or carry. And what are they gonna do with the, did you find a tank in the back like you asked then, or? Yeah. Did um, you, where's um, that at? Are right, we gonna just dump them in there, or are they gonna put some more? Yeah. All right, we'll, we'll take care of the koi real quick. I think them in right. Water. Maybe All right, here come the koi. Somehow we're gonna have to get some more water in here then. That, we put all that in there, they're barely be covered. Yep. This thing got a, yeah, it does, it's plugged, so we're good to go there. We just need to get water in here then. All right, eight buckets of water from the back pond, plus what was in there, and now these guys are taken care of, and uh, Jerry can get the air or whatever needs to be done on these guys as well. Does he know we got him? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, John's tank is looking a little bit more colorful. These are the fish he got from Oifar. Looking good. We got his water going and we got to work on the electric yet. We couldn't get to the meter. It's on the other side of the house where uh, by the ladies drive. So we got to get permission from her to get in there so I can read the meter. But we'll work on that tomorrow. But we did get the water going. And I was talking about, you know, the tires that my brother and, you know, Becky are getting me. Um, <laughs> that I, I found out this was, this was Becky's idea. And if it weren't for you guys, I wouldn't have the car. And my, you know, Becky and Johnny, they pitched in like 1500 bucks. And between you guys and him, I wouldn't have it. And now... Helping out and you know doing the best I can for them Becky it was her idea turned around and I'm getting tires just in time 
So I wanted to say a special thanks to my sister-in-law, Becky. I love you, girl. So I just wanted to say that as well, guys. All right, catch you on the flip side. going nuts because they know I'm going to feed them and I just came back at that time so uh, we're going to feed them hold on alright let the action begin of course you got a lot of top feeders and you got all the bottom guys doing their thing so that was a nice rescue nice little rescue and we got some nice fish. And unfortunately, I was trying to get back to get them tires. I didn't make it, but I'm getting them tomorrow. Uh, in fact, I was supposed to be on the live stream. <laughs> that didn't work out, but I promised to be on next week. So that'll work out. Uh, we got a couple more trips uh, to do. One's going to be uh, just north of Columbus. I think I mentioned that one. The other one's in New York, Brooklyn. That's an eight-hour. We're trying. I'm trying to set that up for this Saturday, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Uh, we'll do our best. But thanks for Mark and uh, John giving me a hand. John finally got his 350 Rubbermaid. He's probably got it set up, and uh, it's for a uh, snapping turtle, one you guys might know of. Uh, and we'll show you when that happens. In the meantime, hit that like, subscribe, and share, and we'll go deeper with the Reaper.